Hey everybody, Reed here. End of my work day today. Long nine hour one. Anyway, I'm uh, staying beside this garden gate here. Nice little willow there that I planted a couple years ago. It branched out so nicely like that because a beaver came by and gnawed on it. If I look just over here, there's another willow. And it's all bent over right now because a beaver took down this alder tree. Right across my fence line there. Thought as I was driving by. Spent a little bit of time today making shelves for uh, all these squashes that I've got. There's another little tree just beside it. Uh, that's a better finger point. And uh, yeah, so more to do. Kind of nice having the uh, beavers there. You know, they're constantly rearranging this back tree line because there's a creek that's right there and they've got a nice little dam that helps to keep this back area all flooded. Right in back of me here. You know, trying to raise up the earth quite a bit. There's the, uh... It's actually hard to see from this angle. But, uh, I'll take you in the greenhouse. You can see the squash patch. Anyway, kind of tired today. Nine hours of uh, labor will do that. And looking forward to putting my middle child to bed tonight. You know, it's one of those things they they all love mum, which of course makes sense. But the notion that sometimes it's Papa's turn to put you to bed. Some it's rained here quite a bit. This is my low area that I just walked through, and it's definitely squishy. Below my feet. There's a thing I call farm carpentry, and that's when you don't take any measurements, you don't use your level, and you just make it work. So, here I go. You can probably see what I'm talking about here. Look, I got all these nice little cuts. Went into it, making it work. You know, I put this together, you got a lot more squash to go in here. A lot more shelves to build out. I gotta do a second row, a middle row in here, coming off. Put the top pieces onto this. Extend it over here, get this RV oven stove unit out of here. And uh, yeah, we'll see if we have enough room. This is one row, I think I've got seven rows to do. And so, squash we picked up. Uh, if you're in the local area and you want to buy some uh, some old sheep wool, especially before it rain, it's rained on, call me as soon as you see this. And see if I'm making that happen. Otherwise, I'll just spread that around different fruit trees and things, and use it as a mulch. Anyway, I didn't want to uh, have the day get past me without chatting with you for a minute, saying hi. Ticking off different boxes, I contacting people. Next thing I gotta contact the doctor. We have like free healthcare, sort of, up here in Canada. And so, uh, I haven't seen the doctor in a few years. Probably a good idea to check in, and get them to run a bunch of tests that I want done. Yeah, figure out what's happening. I'll probably do that tomorrow. But, uh, Hope you're checking off all your things. Harvest time is usually long days, lots going on. Anyway, with that, I hope you have a great night, or whatever time of day it is. And thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing. Links to my current singles in the description here. And have too much fun.